KUTV has been pressing for answers after the University of Utah announced gymnastics coach Tom Farden is on paid administrative leave. Farden on leave now amid emotional and verbal abuse allegations, but the school says the decision to put Farden on leave is not because of student athlete welfare or complaints. KUTV's Amanda Gilbert live. Amanda, you had the chance to talk with somebody whose family's name is connected to many projects on the U's campus. What, what are they saying tonight? I did. First, I want to start by earlier in my day. I actually went to the Board of Trustees meeting here this morning. It was their regularly scheduled meeting. They would not public com or comment publicly on this, but they did actually have a closed session, and they told me that was because of personnel and safety issues. After that, I spoke with this well-known donor for the U of U to get his reaction to the news about Coach Tom Farden. What was your thoughts when you heard about what happened with Coach Farden? Well, I didn't have, I don't have much information on it, so I was shocked. That was well-known University of Utah donor and supporter Spence Eccles' reaction. I've worked with him for years, and so I'm hoping it's all working out because those girls deserve the best. The university said in a statement, Coach Farden's on paid leave because of his, quote, recent conduct and actions which don't align with their values and expectations. While the school said this does not relate to past verbal and emotional abuse allegations surrounding Farden, this is happening just weeks after rising gymnast Kara Aker said she is leaving the team and the sport. I reached out to a sports performance consultant, Robert Andrews. You take a... a a football game. There's so many mistakes made in football games, but they move most of the time they're hidden because the focus is always on the ball. In gymnastics, it's right there and for everyone to see. So uh, there's a lot, of, a lot of pressure on gymnasts to be perfect, which is unfortunate. He hopes. Let the truth come out. If the truth is what is being alleged, then Utah has some responsibility to take appropriate action on this. And the university says that associate coach Carly Dockendorf is going to be taking over as interim head coach. Reporting live in Salt Lake, Amanda Gilbert, KUTV 2 News.